All right, so this is a fun one to document. Me and my bro. Woo! That thing is as big as I get. So we want to respect these fish because they deserve it. And uh, this doesn't happen very often, so you're going to get to see a big monster and then she's going to get released. All right, baby. So take one or two pictures and then I got to let her go. Holy shit, dude! <laughs> Fuck yeah! <laughs> All right, now we're gonna talk about eel skins. Another killer way to trick very big fish. Uh, when I'm fishing eel skins, I usually fish two or three different lures with it. And once again, my absolute go-to is a super strike. Okay, take the hooks off. This is a super strike popper. I, I like to throw the big heavy super strike popper and uh, you don't fish it like a popper, you fish it like a swimmer. So very simple, you get an eel skin. Uh, I'm not gonna skin one right now. I actually have some that are already skinned. I purchased this already, it's been brined. Simple, this is very easy to do. Take the popper, you slide the eel skin up over the popper. All right, there we go. I've already made an incision, All right? That's where my hook's gonna come out. It's measured up, okay? Same exact thing at this point. I'm gonna take my zip tie. Okay, so I'm gonna take my zip tie and I'm gonna pull it around the neck of the popper. And I'm just gonna tighten it down. And that's it. The skin peels back. You trim it. You trim it off with, uh, with the scissors and you're ready to go. Recommend 5X. Mustad 3.0 5X clips right on here and that's all you need you don't need a tail hook uh, and the fish don't mess around they crush this thing it casts half a mile and you just work it like a like a swimmer and that's it that's an eel skin done in about 10 now seconds say you don't want to use a popper next thing I like to use is a bullet same thing heavy cast far uh, it can get out there reach the fish and with the skin they're absolutely gonna crush it now you say how am I gonna put it on this bullet well and make same. an eel skin. Very simple. Same thing again. I'm going to take one of my zip ties and I go right up around the eye, right? So I bring it up here and I and I zip tie it down, okay? And I tighten it. Okay. Once I get it on there, hold on. Okay. That's it. Now, what this zip tie does is when I pull the skin, up around the top of it, it gives me something to tie to. And I'll just tie right onto it, and then you're gonna have an eel skin bullet. Same thing, cast half a mile. Now, if you don't want to use a super strike, you could use any of your favorite metal lips or needlefish. This one is a Chris Voorhees Jr. This is made specifically for an eel skin. If you notice, he's got his notch on it behind the front hook to make it simple for us guys that aren't, uh, aren't really good with their hands. And simple. Take the eel skin. Up. There we go. There we go. Nice and easy. There we are. There we are. Oh. There we go. Up a little bit more. Right. Okay. Now we got it on there, right? And since casting distance is important, this eel skin seen better days. Right. So since casting distance is important to me, I don't leave that much of a tail, okay? That's about it, about an inch and a half. The longer your tail, the less casting distance. Rigging floss again. That's it. I got a little piece. I'm going to do a slip knot over itself. Uh, I actually didn't come up with that knot. I learned it this year at a seminar. Uh, I like going to seminars. Um, you can learn a lot of stuff. Uh, this knot, Toby Lipinski was showing at a seminar at River's End. It works excellent. It tightens down on itself. You only need one knot. That's it. Tighten it down. That's good. I'm going to tighten it down one more time with my pliers. There it is. 
pull it to the sides. That thing's not going anywhere. Cut it off. I'm gonna hit it with a little bit of crazy glue. I use crazy glue for everything. All right. I'm now gonna cut the excess off. This. That's it. Just trim it down. 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 That's it. Another killer plug. All right. All right, guys. So that's about it. Uh, that's how I quickly rig uh, eel skins and eel jigs. That's the uh, Comanche secret weapon for the last couple of years. Uh, we do throw plugs, but these account for our biggest fish. So skins. <laughs> and jigs. So good luck to everybody out there. Once again, thanks for following along. And uh, I'll see you at the uh, fisherman show or maybe on the beach.